Hey guys, Al Escobedo here with CrossbowExpert.com. I'm at the 2024 ATA show. I'm in the Excalibur booth and I got a really exciting crossbow in my hands. This is the Rev X from Excalibur. As you can see, integrated crank system. It's the Charger X, completely silent, but it is clutch so you can safely cock and decock your crossbow. I'm gonna show you how to do that process right here. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our crank handle out out of that slick little storage spot that Excalibur added on this crossbow. You just press your release, slide it right out the end, easy as that. Then basically you're going to set the bow down, and right here you got the trigger lock release. You're going to push that button down, and you're going to slide your, your sliding trigger mechanism down until you click it on the string. Just like the other Excaliburs, it's not going to automatically go into safety, so once you click it onto the string, flip it back into safe, you're ready to go. Stick your crank handle in. Extremely smooth, super quiet. Now you got it all the way cocked. There's one more step you gotta do. And what you're doing is you're gonna take the pressure off of the crank strap and put it onto this trigger lock latch. That'll help you with your accuracy and wear and tear on the, the crank system itself. So now you're just gonna take it out one full turn, two full turns, three turns. Now you're ready to go. You just sat in the woods, you didn't have any success. Now it's time to decock your crossbow. Excalibur made this even more simple than they had in the past. All you do is you slide your crank handle in, go back into the cock position until you got pressure on the crank handle and you can get movement on that trigger lock latch. You hold that trigger lock latch down, then you slowly start decocking the bow. Now you got it in the st back in the static position. I know a lot of guys <clears throat> like to, to disconnect that sliding trigger just for storage purposes. Again, Excalibur made it super easy. So once you're in the static position, you're just going to flip it back to fire. They got a nice little machined hole on the side there. You just press that lever to release the trigger. And you're ready to start winding it back up. That is the Excalibur RevX 400 feet per second. Extremely sleek design, and you can find it at crossbowexpert.com.